Hey guys, this is Gloria. So I am back to share with you guys my um, AliExpress haul that has been trickling in. You guys know that it takes about two weeks or so for your goods to come in, but it, the prices are so worth the wait, guys. So if you have not ordered from them yet, you know, just try it, try a few things, see how you like it. Um, the products are awesome. They are um, better than what you would expect for the price. And I highly recommend them. Even when you have problems, they will rectify the situation. So let me just share with you guys what I picked up. So I picked up this stamp set with the perfume bottles. Um, I stamped out this one as well as this one. They stamp out very clear, very clean. And these are so cute because they're like mixed media kind of perfume bottles. Love this stamp set. Um, I think this was like $3.50, something like that, with free shipping. Um, if I can remember the prices, I will definitely let you know how much I paid for them. Um, this one, I was a little, um, uh, I wasn't upset about it. I wasn't disappointed, but I thought it was going to be larger. As you can see, these images look like, you know, little paint palettes and uh, watercolor paint sets and pencils and um, all kind of little art stuff, journals, and then even this little phrase here. Um, I thought this was going to be much larger. This is pretty small um, for a stamp set. I think this is about three inches long maybe. And this is probably about an inch and a half tall. But it's still really, really cute. I think um, you can also stamp this out and blow it up on a um, printer or something like that to make the images larger. But this stamp set was also about $3.50. Um, I also picked up this one for my planner, but as you can see, film is missing as well as sun is missing. Um, I did notify the seller and um, they issued me a refund for this one. So I didn't have to send it back or anything, but you know, I can't really use it without the Sunday and the film. I really wanted that to mark when I do my YouTube videos. So, um, But they did, you know, right away said, yeah, we're going to send you back a refund. No problem. So it was like $1.25. Um, this one was about uh, 91 cent, I believe, and it's just some alphabet. And I just really liked it because it looked um, kind of like mixed media, kind of different, the way the letters and stuff are. So I got that. And I also picked up this one. I really like this one because you can actually color in the alphabet if you want it. And it comes with the uppercase and the lowercase and some of these little symbols at the bottom. Really, really cute stamp set. Really like this stamp set. I also picked up this one and this is calendars i wish i would have got two of these only because um each month only uh does go up to 31 i would have to either cut it or um maybe mask off some of the numbers because you know not all the months are 31 days and you know um then they do start on different days as you can see here this one starts on monday to, um this one wednesday wednesday let me see Wednesday, Wednesday, uh, Friday. So to kind of make these work, you got to kind of like fiddle with them a little bit, but that's okay. I thought it was really cool to be able to stamp out a calendar on um, my journals and stuff. So I picked that up. Um, I think I showed you guys this in my last haul video, but I didn't show you what the box actually looks like. It's a really, really cute box. And this is what it looks like. Well, actually, this is what it looks like. I had the paper the wrong way, but um, so cute. And it, it's like self-closing, self-locking. You just kind of tuck it in there and it'll stay closed inside of there. You can also put ribbon around it. I just stuck some shred in the inside and I used double-sided paper to um, cut this out. But I thought this was really cute. And it does come with pieces that you can actually cut windows out in an oval or in this little shape here. And there's actually words in there and a little heart. Really, really cute. So I wanted to show you guys what that looks like cut out. I also picked up this mailbox. And it's really cute. It has this little envelope and little heart, little face and this thing here. And this is what that looks like. I just did it with some scrap paper. And these are the little envelopes. And I thought what was so cute about it is that it's kind of an interactive mailbox. Where you can like stick your little notes inside of the mailbox and this i think would look so cute on like a little card or something like that and so i just cut out two little envelopes and stuck them inside and this little flap actually does come up and it can close as well so that was really cute so i picked up that i also picked up this and this was like 71 cent i believe 
and what it is is just a um, bow with some hearts dangling from it and let's try not to tear it uh, okay can't get it off of there there we go I didn't want to tear it up because I can actually use this die cut but um, that's what it looks like and it actually comes with um, three hearts that cut out separate from the die which is this one this one and this one right here so it makes these little separate um, three little separate hearts as well so I thought that was really cute I thought it was just a really cute little piece and it was only like 71 cents so not bad and then um, last but not least I want to share with you guys this die that I picked up now this die is a house die and it's very 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 similar to this Spellbinders die that I also have. Um, it has the same pieces, the whole nine, except this one is smaller than the Spellbinders die. But I cut both of them out so that you can see the difference in the sizing. And honestly, I do like the size of this one um, a little bit better than I like the Spellbinder one. But you'll see what I mean in a minute. So this is the one from AliExpress and I left one side open, you know, just in case I wanted to do something different with it, use it as a box or something. But this is the one from AliExpress, and this is the one from Spellbinders. And as you can see, there's a little bit of a difference in size in both of them. And But they do come with the same exact pieces, and I left the flap up on this one here. But um, I do actually like this one, you know, a little bit better. Um, this is so cute. You can, make, you know, use these for Christmas and put some um, ribbon up top and hang these on the tree for little ornaments. I just thought this this little house was super cute. You can actually even line the windows up on the house itself, cut the windows out, and then you know glue the windows back in and put vellum in there. I mean, all all kind of stuff. But if you are, you know, if you like this house from Spellbinders, you will love this one from AliExpress, and this one costs about two seventy five or something like that. So I mean, a fraction of the cost. So you know. But that's up to you to decide um, and so that's about it for my haul for right now like I said stuff is steady trickling in so once it comes in I will definitely share with you guys what I get in I'll try to you know cut some stuff out because I know that it really helps me um, when I go to the websites and stuff to see the actual um, items not so much you know the sizing and all that stuff because sometimes the sizing is a little off or sometimes um, it just doesn't make sense to me. So um, I just wanted to share with you guys that. Oh, real quick. I also picked up this. This was 60 cent and it's just a silicone mold of a bow. And it's a really cute small size. So I really like that. And like I said, it was 60 cent with free shipping. And then I also picked up these. And these were 24 cent each. And this one is a little hard. And then I also got four of the bowls. And like I said, they were 24 cents each. And the reason why I picked them up is for the Traveler's Notebook. Because, let me see if I can take this out. If you guys could see, the back of these necklaces, um, if you can see that, the back of this is, you know, it has these holes through it. So what I thought about was putting elastic through these and using these as um, little closures on the front of the Traveler's Notebook. So I thought that would be really cute. And the heart is the same exact way. It has like the two holes on the back of it. So I thought that was really cute. So I bought four of each of those. And then, oh, last but not least, I did pick up this ring. It was 71 cent. And mind you guys, I have washed dishes in this ring. I have um, washed my hands and all kind of stuff. And it hasn't turned or done anything that it shouldn't do. Um, it hasn't even turned my finger green or anything like that. So I thought that was a great deal for 71 cent. It was either 71 cent or 91 cent. I can't really remember right now. But it's just a little bow ring that I wear on my other hand. So I thought that was really cute. I wanted to share with you guys that too. So not only do they have crafty goodies, they also have all kind of stuff. Anything that you think you're looking for, they have it on there. You just have to be really prepared to sit down and really go through 
page by page and see what you want and just have an idea in mind of what you want to pay for the items and you know once you find something that's a good price for you then just go ahead on and buy it and like I said I haven't had a, um, any trouble yet so I do recommend them I do like the site and I love the prices all right guys so that is about it um, I will talk to you guys very soon God willing and if you guys have any uh, questions or comments please leave them down below I'll get back with you as soon as I possibly can take care guys bye